I just think that a room is a place that you should be able to go to and just relax and feel really comfortable. So that's why I've spent quite a bit of time in making my room into something that I want to enjoy spending time in. special place that you should make just the way you like it. It doesn't have to be expensive at all. Even something as simple as just painting your room can really make it into a space that you will love. Welcome to my room. Uh, I'll just take you around a tour of it and just kind of explain things as I go. Here I have this fake orchid because I can't possibly have a real orchid on my desk because there's not enough light for it on my desk. I have this big calendar that I use to plan out things or write any important dates that I have. This is my book where I keep um, all of my to-do lists, or journal entries, or just if I have thoughts that I don't want to forget, I'll just write them down. This book pretty much just has everything in it that I could need. Here I have my little display for my crystals. On the top here, I have my pendulum, and I have my huge chunk of amethyst that was actually my great aunt's. This kind of glass dust case display thing over it. And then here is my Himalayan salt lamp. This is what it looks like without when the light's not on. I absolutely love it. In case you're wondering, it is real salt. I licked it once and it was a horrifying experience. <laughs> I always have to have my external hard drive plugged in because this is where my iMovie and iPhoto is stored because there is absolutely no more room on my MacBook. I just recently got The Magic by Rhonda Byrne and then this is a super heavy <laughs> wood piece of art that my boyfriend made me. He completely made this from scratch, just from a giant slab of wood. I absolutely love it. I can't believe that he made this. <laughs> Under my desk, I just have some, my camera case, some school binders, and this basket of textbooks, random assignments that I need to throw out, um, my tarot cards, yeah, it's just a random basket. <laughs> this is my bed. I just recently painted my room. Before, my room was actually turquoise, and this bed and pillow did not match as well. But now, and I have this beautiful embroidered pillow that my parents got me as a gift. And it matches my room perfectly now since I got it painted. Up here, I just have a photo of my boyfriend and I at my grade 12 prom and this was like exactly four years ago <laughs> actually and there's my boyfriend looking all like a baby this is my succulent that is pretty much my pride and joy because i got this at the grocery store and it was 50 percent off because this plant right here you can see it's rooted in but you could actually just pick it up it was completely detached from the soil and it was about this tall and i've kept them here right in the sun gave them occasionally some water and now they've grown into these beautiful succulents. The same with this one. Whenever my succulents start growing too much towards the sun then I just rotate them around so that they grow straight and they're actually pretty straight right now. And then I just have my plant on top of my healing stones that I talked about in my what I got recently video so if you want to see the contents of this box you can go watch that and here I have my aloe vera right here I have this dream catcher that my best friend made me for Christmas and it's just my favorite thing it's not like a regular dream catcher that you see it's like really random and made from things that she found around our friend's house so here is my little dish where I keep my mala beads and my bracelets so i've got some jade and rose quartz and smoky quartz and this is a watch that my mom just gave me i think two of these stones fell out so 
she just gave it to me and my jewelry tree so this was made for me by my best friend Elvira and this is my Pandora bracelet that I got quite a few years ago some charms on there and then this one as you may be able to tell is a metal one that was given to me by my boyfriend. Uh, there's a soccer ball on it because he is a soccer player so I will never forget who gave it to me. Yeah, I love this bracelet. It has a purple theme because my favorite color is purple. And here's like my only pair of dangly earrings that I own and actually wear. Elvira told me that a room doesn't look finished until it has curtains and until I got curtains, I did not agree with her, but now I fully agree. Here I just have a very fake but real looking plant. I used to have a palm tree in my room and it died because it didn't get enough sun, so I didn't want that to happen again because I felt really bad. And this is another gift from my best friend Katie. It has my name on it. It's a little elephant that she decorated. A little stack of candles. I have a map where you can scratch off the places that you've been in the world. And some of the places I've been don't even have a little place to scratch. Like a lot of places in here. This is a flower crown that I made at Yoga Fest. Bracelets. And then here is my collection of jewelry. So I've got some crystals. Um, I've got these wrapped crystals that I actually will be doing a video on very soon because some people have been asking me how I made them. So yeah, I'm going to show you a video on how to make these necklaces. And then I also have a rainbow moonstone necklace that I love. And then here's just some gold one. I've got this peace sign that my dad gave me. And then here I've got some Polaroids. So there's me and my boyfriend. And this is me <laughs> uh, trying my best to pop champagne when I finished writing my ebook. I had a little ebook launch party. Look at our faces. That's like when the cork popped. I was so scared I was gonna like hit one of us in the eye. <laughs> Eventually I'm going to be putting this picture over here. Um, but it took a lot of time to get this up so I have to wait until we can get like all the right equipment to move it. Yeah, this is my room right now and maybe if you guys want you can make a room tour yourself and show me what your room looks like. I will see you guys next time and I hope you have an awesome day.